noises. Hey, what's going on, everybody? AFC Northerners, Jan Davis Utara, Ravens guy, and I am Joy. Tell them who you are. What's up? I'm Nick Slack, and I'm one of the co-founders of the West Wing in LA. There you go. So Ravens fans, right here, one of the co-founders, and what a fucking first half. Yeah. Okay. First of all, the negative. Ronnie Stanley, two penalties for I think 20 yards. That's got to be cleaned up. Um, Webb took a little bit of a nasty hat. We were a little worried about that. So let's get on to the good. Let's get on to the last negative thing, and that is the fucking hit on Flacco. That was absurd. Fuck you, TK Alonzo. Yeah. Go fuck yourself. Holy shit. I hope that you are suspended for the rest of the fucking season and just fine. I find out the ass. Anyway, for real though, yes, Alex yes. Collins fucking beast mode, right? Baby beast mode. All right, so baby beast mode was in so much great effect. Ryan Malik comes in with a fucking touchdown uh, to Ben Watson, which was so fucking badass. Oh yeah, my that god! Was incredible. And then the first touchdown of the the game, Macklin. right to Macklin, just beautiful, 35 yard pass, absolutely wonderful. I'm really loving what I'm seeing from the offensive line, even though they're not. I mean, they're not the greatest. Like, they're, they're opening up holes. Yeah. Um, Buck Allen's been a little disappointing. Hasn't been able to really make a lot has happened as, as I'd like. Uh, Vince Mayo's in concussion protocol, so we haven't seen a lot there. But Flacco's dead. It, well, we'll see. We'll see. But here's the thing. Dolphins now don't realize that they just started a fucking rivalry. Yeah. Like, it, we're pissed now. We're taking on the whole AFC we are, East. We are totally fucking pissed. I think that this may, uh, what do you think about like this being the game that might give the fire to the Ravens back for the rest of the season? We go in, by the way, yeah. reminder, Flacco got into concussion protocol, but after this game, it's our bye. Yeah. We got 10 days to like get our shit together. So there's some positives to take dude, there. So dude, yeah, I, Exactly. Judon's stepping up big oh time. Oh my dude. God, that one up. just like bam. Mosley's finally showing up in a big way. He I is. love that. He's getting tackles and he's getting touches on every play. So fucking good. Uh, I just think we need to, our secondary needs to set up, step up and that could be a huge thing. But our biggest thing is we haven't gotten pressure on the quarterback. You know, I mean, that's, well, we've gotten a lot of sacks though. Like a lot we of have sacks. Like five? Yeah, like we, so there's that. Jefferson stepped up a little bit. Yeah, uh, which is good. We've seen a lot better on that. Weddle almost ha helped with get that interception. So many picks tonight we could have so had. So many. They, the, Miami's been playing dirty, and Very. I don't know if it's intentional, but it, that's got to stop. Yeah, I mean, they, they are playing so gross, so dirty. Let's back up here for this guy. Car! Yeah! Car! Game on! Game on! <laughs> anyway, <laughs> so. Oh man, like what was so so far on the defense? What have you seen that you were you were not happy about? I'm not happy about these, and this has been like killing us all year long. These these third downs, getting the yep. ten yards or fifteen yep. yards, get, they're just giving up those conversions. Absolutely, and we can't do that and, and win sustain wins. But we've been doing it tonight, yeah, which has helped us because we've just been putting applying pressure to the quarterback. And here's the thing: I think also is uh, what I. A counterpoint to that, what I have liked, again, seeing Webb and Jefferson both step up. Weddle's been a little quiet, but he's been actually really good at containing receivers. Yeah. Uh, if you're watching this game and you want to see something interesting, really start watching Jefferson and Webb. Yeah. What they're doing in the backfield is some really sneaky good work. So credit to them. Yeah. Uh, also, Williams and like Zadarius Smith, yeah. Ju like just our D. It's so good to have Brandon back. It, uh, Brandon Williams is, is now, really now deal. Pierce can play like he, he's like that nose tackle exactly. with Brandon, and it's just a one two punch. It's like Sam Adams and Syracuse all over again. That's fucking good combination. Yeah. All right, so Jimmy I gave Chip. a prediction at the uh, on today's show. Uh, I think God twenty three seven something like that. I'm so happy to be wrong. Ravens fans, let's fucking kill this. Thirty eight to seven. Thirty eight to seven. You know what? Last time we played was thirty eight six, right? Yeah. Nah. Thirty. Let's keep it thirty eight three. That's thirty eight three. Yeah, keep it thirty eight three. All right, guys. Thank you again for tuning in. We'll be back here for the show next week. Let's go Ravens. Days. Bye week coming up. Bye guys. Oh, let me focus up. West Wing LA. Check it out guys. Bye Ravens fans. AFC Northerners out. Suck the Browns. <laughs>